so we finally have evolution xos latest version the first customer which is out with november security patch as far as i, as I know in the previous previous month this was the first customer too with the latest security patch and in this month this is the first one the evolution x version 7.3 is what we have with november security patch as i just mentioned it includes a lot of new changes and most importantly we have face unlock and i'll talk about all those things in this video so stay tuned and make sure to watch this video till the end we are talking about the latest version which is based on android 13 of course i'm not going to talk about android 12 or android 12.1 if you want to use android 12 or android 12 l based custom rooms you can check out their previous updates or maybe you can try out lineage os which is improving and which is giving you updates but maybe uh, according to some times what we have is the face unlock which is one of the main highlights about this one it's just working perfectly fine of course let me show you how the things are going on okay recognizing face and it's good also it's uh, it's actually fast i have tried face unlock in one other custom room it is not that fast but in this case like in evolution x OS, it is actually fast so yes it's something really nice the feature is actually super good as expectedly this feature maybe i was expecting this feature with the november security patch and this is what we have and maybe most likely this feature will be implemented in almost every custom room second change what we have here is in this screenshot ui now we have the google lens button integrated so whenever i take screenshot you can see we have the google lens button so if you have google lens installed it will open google lens automatically but in my case it's not installed so it is it is just saying me to install that so yes it's up to you the thing is i'm sharing with you the changes which we have with this november security patch or you can say the evolution x version 7.3 what we have changes what the changes we have in this version i'm just sharing with you all those things so if you were looking for the benchmarks or how the battery backup etc you can check out other device specific reviews which are available on youtube another change or another new thing which we found here is in the screen recording you can see where many options like record audio, show touches on screen, stop dot, lower quality, bigger file size limit, skip timer as expectedly and enable HEVC. These are the options which we have in this screen recording which is actually super good. Another one what we have is now in the private DNS mode. We have two extra DNS options available. Ad guard to simply block ads from your device which I most likely use or maybe 99% of the times I use this. You also have the option to use Cloudflare DNS if you want to. And these are inbuilt. If these are not inbuilt, you can still use them. But inbuilt is inbuilt. Another change which we have here is in the internet tile, which is actually available in many other customers already. But with this Evolution XOS, now we have. This is hotspot. Whenever you open internet, if your device has SIM card and Wi-Fi, and then now we also have the hotspot option, which is quite useful in some cases and maybe this is the last but not the least we have some battery style customizations available so the status bar battery style can be changed we have many options available we have landscape styles we have landscape or portrait or text or etc etc you can customize your device you can simply theme your device according to your own preference you can customize the styles etc okay this is another change which we found here is in the dark theme so if you are a lover of dark themes, I mean, if you always use, if you love to use dark theme on your device, you can use this. We have some custom themes available, black, clear, vivid, monet, and monet. If you want to use this thing, you can. I think so. As far as I know, these themes are actually available in Repainter app too. So if you haven't purchased Repainter, you will get all these themes free here of course not all those but maybe these two or three if you want to use these themes you can these are available by default in this one and these themes are only be available for the dark theme users so if you are one of the users who love to use light theme then these themes are not for you these were some visual changes the major changes which we find which we found after installing evolution x version 7.3 other than else, this room always has a lot of customizations. You can see miscellaneous ignore window secure flag, which is a quite useful feature. Game space, which is a very interesting concept. Other options are just good. We have many customization options. Go and explore all those things. Link for the official website, official download links are already available in the description. This is all from today's short and simple video. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one. Goodbye.